Hello, my name is Dr. Nitiraj Oberoi. I'm a consultant orthopedic surgeon at Dharamshila Narayana Super Speciality Hospital at New Delhi. There are lots of questions people have about joint pains. And today, let me take the opportunity of discussing some of the salient points of joint pains with you. So any pain in and around a joint is classified as a joint pain. Anybody can get it. The young, the old, the infirm, the athletically active. So just because you have been a great athlete doesn't mean you will not get joint pains. If you're very old, the reasons are different. If you're young, the reasons are very different. So reasons for joint pains can be injury, inflammation such as rheumatoid arthritis. It can be certain deposit disease such as gout. It can be as a result of infection, but largely it is as a result of use. These are called degenerative joint pains and they're also called mechanical derangement joint pains. Joint pains can also come as a result of sporting activity. So you can injure your ligaments, your cartilages inside the joint, giving rise to swelling, pain and stiffness in your joints. How do we diagnose these? Well, if you have pain which persists all the time, or at least if it persists for a week or two, along with swelling and stiffness, which does not respond to painkillers, or responds to painkillers and the pain comes back, is associated with fever or involvement of multiple joints, please do meet your doctor. He will advise you how to go about investigating your problem and at least getting to know what kind of joint pain you have. Once we know that you have a joint problem, what can we do about it? Most joint pains can be managed conservatively, which means non-operatively. Essentially, it's medication, medication for pain, medication for managing diseases which may have caused joint pains, such as anti-rheumatoid medication. It can also be as a result of mechanical or, or degenerative disorder. This is also because of mechanical derangement. In such cases, we use collagen analogs. Collagen and glucosamine analogs help to give nutrition to the joint and in larger doses also help reduce the inflammatory mediators inside a joint. But what happens if nothing seems to work? Well, the doctor may ask you to rest, use a walking stick, get some physiotherapy. But if we are at the end of the road and nothing seems to fall into place, then we have to look at surgery. In surgery, we can try to preserve your joint, which means we do not replace it. This is usually reserved for people who are younger or have joint problems as a result of mechanical axis deviation or in a single compartment of a multi-compartment joint. This is through processes known as osteotomies where joint can be given its correct alignment and hence pressure causing areas can be reduced. If you have to go for surgery of joint replacement, please do not despair. Results are brilliant. In the last 40 years, a lot of research has gone into developing better joints for you, which are better in terms of metallurgy, in terms of biomechanics, you feel normal with these joints and more so now with newer surgical tools such as navigation, we are able to give your joint in as near alignment as your original joint was. This produces better function and longer results.